Yeah, thank you. Years in the making, work has finally begun to tear down Peoria's Taft Homes and replace it with Providence Point. Alex Gall spoke with several stakeholders and current residents about their hopes and hesitations about this project. One, go! A new beginning for Taft Homes. It goes from barrack style to a real neighborhood. We said what we were going to do. We've done what we said we was going to do. We're excited to be part of that transformation for the residents. Thursday's groundbreaking included everyone from residents to community leaders and elected officials from city, state and federal levels. Depending on where you come in at, this is one of the first housing developments or pieces of property that you see. It's going to be a beautiful look. Uh, on entering our city. When it's done, the newly named Providence Point will include 142 units. That's fewer than before, but the idea is to build each one big enough for a full family. What the change means is improved quality of living and pride of where we live. Peoria Housing Authority's Jackie L. Newman admits to a lot of bumps in the road to get here, but she hopes the new homes will offer new identity to the community and hope for the future. Our families have waited a long time. They've been promised much, and sometimes those promises have felt empty to them. So today was delivery day. PHA has said current residents will get first choice for new apartments at Providence Point, but some residents are still skeptical. I just hope that when it's all said and done, that the families that's in the TAF, hopefully they really do be allowed into Providence Point. But city leaders say this is the answer, and they are happy that this $50 million project is now a development, with completion expected in 2023. I'm Alex Gall, 25 News, Peoria.